Christmas, fellow Canadians. I'm Harper Stevens, your Conservative Party Member of Parliament for the riding of Tar Heel, Alberta. And I'm here with my lovely wife, Imelda, to bring you a special holiday greeting from the Stephen Harper government. In the heartwarming holiday classic, A Christmas Carol, Ebenezer Scrooge asks, are there no prisons? Are there no workhouses? And this Christmas, I'm proud to answer with a resounding, yes, my friends, there are prisons. And how exciting is this? We're building more of them. By next Christmas, we'll have enough prison cells for every Canadian. Not only that, I'm pleased to announce that as a special conservative Christmas surprise, we're bringing back workhouses. In today's global economy, we need to remain competitive to keep Canadian businesses right here in Canada. And that means being open to some of China's more successful innovations like lower minimum wages, non-union factories, and compassionate child labor. I had a lemonade stand when I was five. And since we all know that there's nothing Canadians want more during the holidays than to go somewhere warm, we're doing all we can to promote global warming to heat things up right here at home. By withdrawing from the Kyoto Accord, Ew. lobbying against pesky international climate regulations, and sharing the gift of our precious oil sands, we believe that one day soon, Canada will be doing more to increase the rate of global warming than any other country on the planet. Thanks to conservative policies, it won't be long before we'll have palm trees right here in Alberta. God bless us, everyone. For my family and the Stephen Harper government, Merry Christmas, Canada. Oh, we've got to go. Peter McKay just arrived to pick us up in his helicopter. Merry Christmas. Ooh.